So if Facebook is doing this like settlement thing, I'm actually surprised it sent me a notification. I've had Facebook for I don't know how many long now, how many years now. I did the one with Uber and I didn't have to do anything. It filtered me out. I think I waited like a month and I got a couple hundred bucks out of it. So if that's just Uber and this is Facebook, then who knows? It's obviously gonna be free. I don't care if I get twenty bucks out of it, I'll probably forget about it and one day I'll get the check in the mail. Because you know, basically the lawyers or whatever they take the cut and they give you the rest of it, which is probably ten percent or something, so who knows? Um, so let's view some of the details. Because a lot of people are saying, Oh, here's five bucks. So you have to do it by July. It doesn't tell you how much is the question. A cash payment for the settlement by submitting a timely and properly completed claim form to obtain approval on the settlement of the If your claim proves them, so you will get the upright to sue the defendant in separate law suit about legal claims. Hell yeah. Allegations. It's, it's basically because Facebook was using your identity improperly through Cambridge Analytica or whatever the company is. AKA their meta bullshit. So you can choose to opt out of the settlement and receive no payment. This option allows you to sue, continue to sue, or be part of another lawsuit against the defendant related to the legal claims. Yeah, I want the money, bro. I'm broke. Object to the settlement and or attend a hearing. No, thank you. Do nothing. Um, it doesn't really tell you how much would be great. But, yeah, I'm definitely going to submit a claim because why not? It's free. Uh, a lawyer or whatever in California... Wherever this company is that's doing this on Facebook, I'm sure Facebook legally has to notify you like they did me. So, I'm going to submit a claim. I'm sure it automatically puts information in. I'm sure somewhere on Facebook it says since I've had it, when I've had it. So, I'm pretty sure it signed up in like 2003 or four. or something. Let's submit a claim, see where it goes. Da, 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 your contact information. So it looks like you just do standard stuff. I hope it knows when you've had Facebook because I'm not sure. But I'm sure it'll I'm like to do that. And like with the Uber one, I think it was like a three minute phone call or something. I don't know, something stupid. Did you reside in the United States anytime between? Yeah. Were you a Facebook user anytime between May 24th? Um, I'm going to put yes. Oh, uh, provide the date range you were a Facebook user. Okay, so before I start this, I'm going to have to go back and see when I started Facebook. So if you're wondering, and at least one of the email addresses, phone numbers, and your username associated with your Facebook account. Okay, so you have to put your Facebook uh, email. Put your phone number, apparently. Uh, username, so please make sure your payment or email phone match your account. Oh, so I'm... They literally direct deposit money into your account. That's fucking li God bless America. Because with Uber, I had to wait for a check, and it was like weeks. And I think they gave me two different ones. I think one was like one twenty five, and it was like two twenty five or something. So, uh, Venmo because that's ruined my life. Um, Zelle, Zelle, I'll probably use Zelle. So make sure you get your bank information or PayPal stuff like that. Or Get a prepaid MasterCard? What? This is lit. Only in America, bro. So if you're wondering how this works, um, PayPal, I don't need PayPal. Verification attendance by saying below. Oh, so it's electronic signature. So that's, that's literally how it works. So you need your bank information. You need your Facebook username. You need the Facebook uh, start date or end date or whatever. And that's basically it. And then pick how you want to get paid. That's something funny if it's like a dollar. I've literally gotten a check for 25 cents before. Okay. But if this is all I have to do to get paid from Facebook, then so be it. I mean, I've had Facebook forever. Clearly, I've had it before 2007, I think. So make sure you know this beforehand, before submitting your claim. So I was wondering how this works, because I see it on TikTok all the time. People are like, oh, you're going to get paid 25 cents. But I don't think the lawyers would go through all that trouble for 25 cents. I think they would just file it on your behalf and be done with it. So this is how it works. Um... 
if I get anything in email after filling this out, I'll probably make a video or put it in the comments what's happening. Uh, I'll, and if I ever get paid, I'll tell you how much I got paid. Um, you know, I'm an open book for most things. So um, you might want to fill this out too. It's easy money.